Okay, today we're going to be talking about classifying triangles by angles. And there's four types of triangles. First, there's the acu acute triangle. And like the name suggests, it's a triangle with three acute angles. And re remember, an acute angle is just an angle who is greater than 0 degrees and less than 90 degrees. Okay, next we have the obtuse triangle and it has one obtuse angle and for this one that is right here and an obtuse angle is just an angle who is greater than 90 degrees but less than 180 degrees. Our fourth or third type of triangle is a right triangle and it has one right angle right here. Now a right angle is an angle whose measure is equal to 90 degrees. And there's two ways you're going to know this. Either they're going to tell you that it's a right angle, or there's going to be a little square right here to indicate that it's a right angle. You can't just um, think it looks like a right angle and say it's a right angle. You have to be told that it is a right angle. Now, our fourth kind of triangle is an equilateral triangle. And like uh, equilateral triangle whose sides are congruent, all their angles are also congruent. So this symbol just means congruent, and when we're congruent, the angles have equal measure. So we can mark this by do, making, we can mark them as congruent by doing this. These little tick marks indicate that it's, these angles are congruent. Okay, so now we're going to do an example. We have triangle ABC and triangle BCD. And because the triangles are already marked, we know that these three angles are congruent. So since the measure of angle BCA is equal to 60 degrees and angle BCA, angle CAB, and angle ABC, are all congruent, we know that the measure of angle CAB is also 60 degrees and the measure of angle ABC is 60 degrees as well. So this is 60 and this is 60. So that makes triangle a, B, C, and equilateral and acute triangle because all three angles are equal and all three angles are less than 90 degrees. So we want to find out what kind of triangle triangle B, D, C is. This triangle right here. Well, if you look at these two angles right here, you'll notice that they're supplementary angles. So we can add 60 plus, we're going to call this angle, angle X, plus X, and we're going to set that equal to 180 to find out how big X equals. So if we subtract 60, we find X equals 120 degrees. And since 120 is greater than 90 but less than 180, we know that this is 
an obtuse angle. So that makes triangle BDC an obtuse triangle. Be sure to watch the next video where we're going to talk about the interior angles of triangles.